What the flippin' flamingo was that? I don't know. Let's split up and find out. No more students coming from this school. Now, to destroy that banana hunting incel. You're never gonna get away with this, you pubed hair peckerheads. Shut your hole or I'll open the other one. Do you like your c served with salt or pepper? I bet your mother served it real well when you're fondling her pancake titties. Ah! You, oh! you think this is a joke, you little tape faced b? What do you think you're doing, tough guy, huh? So f ah! <laughs> Those little assholes can really get on your nerves, can't they? Holy sh! It's him! Good to finally find some allies. Holy what the f?
broke my loose ass. What the hell was that? a huge fucking mistake today. And that mistake was existing. Ah! Ha 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 ha! Fucking cum socks. What the hell? We both want to kill these banana fucks. Why attack me? Because fuck you! That's why. Ah! <laughs> I will shove your beak so far up your urethra, both of your guys will feel it! Don't you f***ing kill you? What the f***? F***ing dirty f***! Prepare your crop dispenser, you little wiggle dicks, because we're locking you up forever. <laughs> gonna fight me? Or are you too scared to get dominated like the trash goblin freak you are? Oh look, I have a french fry right here little bitch. Come get it. That's it. Come get dinner you chode eating shit sack. Can you even understand me or should I be speaking retard? <laughs> Yes, Sensei! 
All I want is to be epic. Submit to the ways of the food, and you will be epic. And good. And sweet. Now, my student, in order to achieve a true state of epic, you must add this maneuver to your skill set. You must show every pussy ass bitch to his boss and perform the stupendous takedown on a cock washing fold whenever you deem necessary. You cocksucket! You'll never overcome those wank stains! Why not? I kicked your banana asses up and down the block, didn't I? You don't get it, you f***ing spinter! These things are undefeatable! Why do you think we came to your planet in search of a new home? Looking for a new home? These scrolls wanted to kill every organism on Earth just for the hell of it. That doesn't sound like desperation to me. Oh yes! Oh, f*** that planet! What? Okay, just tell me what it is we're dealing with here. These creatures are known as the cowboy seagull hybrids. They're a vicious breed of warriors born of a desire for complete dominance by way of shit stirring. I came here to tear all of your asses open so far your bodies would become giant inside out intestines, but it looks like I've got a bigger problem. We've held up a fight against them for years, but it seems they've grown too fing epic. Well, I have two sucking enemy teams to destroy. You got any tips against these f***ers? Where do they come from? It's a long story. I don't think we have time. Fine. They come from Earth. Not surprising knowing that shithole. The stories tell of a man who worked in the retail industry. Once in a meeting, he felt compelled to make a suggestion for future operations. The man stands up and says, When we load up the trucks with merchandise, we should stop them horribly, so the workers who unload them at the store have boxes fall all over them in the process. And maybe we could put boxes of paint cans at the top, so they can fall and explode in their clothes too. He was immediately fired for the terrible idea. I mean, what right-minded human would stack trucks like that? <laughs> Anyways, the man goes outside filled with anger and fucks a seagull. And there you go, the seagull hybrids are born. Whoa, what the fuck? I feel like we're missing some details there. Yes, yes, hold your tits. The legend says the seagull hybrid who was born was able to reproduce into an entire army, eventually growing into their natural instinct, which was to take over the truck-loading sector of the retail industry. The seagulls managed to infiltrate the very aspect of retail they intended to, and eventually took it over. They set up cameras inside the trucks they would load up, so they could watch the workers struggle as they unloaded their poorly stacked boxes. It brought them satisfaction. So much satisfaction, they would sometimes take out revolvers and shoot into the sky while screeching their infamous cry. Yaw! 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 Isn't that you banana fox thing? We grow accustomed to it. So, their lust for using revolvers when in a happy state led to the use of cowboy hats, and thus began the completion of their evolution. The cowboy seagull hybrids. Part seagull, part human, with cowboy attire. So they stack trucks horribly, huh? Rick, these cutting, touchy looking bollocks have been ruining my life long before you snot pukes. They conquered their occupation so well, they spread their disgusting desires to our planet, looking for another place to claim victim, and we've been at war ever since. <sighs> I feel a little gay saying this, but there must be some way we can work together against these creepy nipple twisters.
I'd sooner listen to Cardi B on repeat for 400 hours than collaborate with you. Listen, you little vomit-snoring mamook. We won't accomplish anything by sitting here and crying ourselves to suicide. We have to come up with something. Well, I have something. How about you jump off a cliff, you son of a bitch? How would he even get to a cliff right now? Right. Well, show me how to fight the way you do then, since you're so fucking epic and all. My fighting skills are also good and sweet. Are you sure you can handle that cupcake? If I can handle your mom's fat ass, I can handle just about anything. Get ready, you monkey snack. You got a lot to learn. The martial art of who is not to be taken lightly. Any student of this doctrine of fighting is expected to grow the capability of being really f***ing cool and awesome. Which is why this is virtually hopeless for you. F*** yourself with a sword! Our best chance at f***ing these egg-laying cunts up is to combine our f***ing food skills and hope for the best. Because obviously you useless f***s have no way of beating them on your own. I suppose I cannot argue with that! Let us put our epic together. Maybe these seagull cowboy f***ing things will succumb to our unbeatable sweetness. Let's hope your banana ass is able to handle the unbelievable amount of cool sh** I'm about to teach you. I'm ready. Oh gosh, it's getting boring in here, always surrounded by the same pathetic p***s. You hear me, bitch? Yeah, yeah! Yeah, go shoot up some more needles, you hobo fucking turtle dicks! Does your mother know you're a grower, not a shore?
Young one, you are my greatest student. Your skills have unexpectedly grown so epic. I even saw my cat sobbing about it. I am honored to receive your training and your feedback sensei. I've given you everything I know, so I now leave you to participate in the next tournament. Except for one thing. Yes? My student, I wasn't sure if you were awesome enough to handle this last maneuver. But you have undoubtedly proven me wrong. In the fantastic and elegant art of Fu, the environment is your friend. Everything you see can and should be used to your motherfucking advantage. Like this! We do not tolerate toxic white males here. Prepare to meet your doom, mother Test my fruit flavored tent, bitch. Fucking feminists on this planet, too? Plop? Little bitch! My name is Mike Hawk, you slippery slime ball. Her name could be Dwayne The Rock Johnson, and I still wouldn't give a f. I don't care. Where the hell do I find these cowboy seagull asshats? I don't know. Why don't you take a peek up your rectum? If you're not gonna help, you might as well go figure yourself in a bush and piss off. Would you love to see that, wouldn't you? I would like nothing more than to see a massive pitchfork straight through your skull! Yo! 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 Looks like my search is over. Yo! 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 Remember your super epic fuck food training? You might make it through this. I already made it through your mother. Don't worry about me. Those feathery butt gobblers really messed me up. Man up.
Look, there are rumors about who's been commanding the seagulls. Not much is known about their chain of command, but I can take you to our best guess, and maybe you can take down these squawk suckers for good. Well, let's do it. Lead the way. This is the place. Many of our soldiers were sent here to investigate, but none ever returned. We believe this place is being protected and contains something important, or someone important. This place is pretty heavy. I wouldn't be so confident, Turd Muncher. Pisses me off. Are you twinks here to offer your meat? Only for you to suck, you fugly abomination. Oh ho ho. You've come to the wrong place then, muchacho. Don't think I don't know exactly who the fuck you are. I've deployed my seagulls all over your planet just to piss you and your kind off, and I've been successful as a horny rabbit. All the stress? All the death? It was a result of you? How am I supposed to believe this shit? You're a fucking banana with a bird face! Because I'm the trash snatcher. I've mastered the art of the alien banana. I've led the cowboy seagulls into glory. And I'm gonna kick your little ass. Lit flicking sack of diarrhea. I'm gonna stomp your skull into. Your schizophrenic schemes end today, freak! Mike won't let your flaccid ass stay alive! You little fruitcakes have delayed our mission for long enough. Time to end your disgusting and calcium-filled life. You couldn't peck a hole through a piece of bread if you tried, butt tickler! <gasps> Release me! I'll find your mother and make you call me daddy! Get over here and make this quick. I've got a truck loading industry to abuse.
mother Banana War has come to a close, thus the invasion is at an end. As I've fought these piss-drinking fruit snacks, I've been able to grow to my full potential. I'm so motherfucking awesome that I just can't believe it. The Cowboy Seagull hybrids will no longer ruin the truckloading industry, meaning my stress has dropped by about 50%. In light of more possible threats, I will become the Sensei of Fuck Fu Academy. I will commit myself to training more students in honor of my master and my previous apprentice. There's literally no possibility for anyone on earth to become as epic and cool and great as me. But with my help, the future of Fuck Fu can still thrive better than a gay bar in San Francisco. Although my extremely epic conflict with the alien bananas is over, I can only thank them. I can thank them for giving me my unbelievably fucking sweet title. My name is Mike Hawk. And I'm the Epic Banana Hunter.